You know, it's something we didn't do right away, which is kind of stupid. We didn't see what we can make with chorus fruit. There might be some modded thing that chorus fruit is used for. Fruit crumble. Fruit cream festival bread. What does that even mean? <laughs> it sounds delicious, though. I want some. 28,800 in the culinary generator, and chorus fruit soup is 1,015,200 in the culinary generator? Dude, that's better than my scrambled eggs. That's just chorus fruit with a pot. I hate that. But it's not like I can just jam... Well, I've got enough power. <laughs> power supply with scrambled eggs actually is quite enough. I just need to make the capacity larger. I've got really, really good, consistent power with scrambled eggs, I'm not going to lie. It's kind of OP. Oh, we found it! Yes! Well, I guess a hot dog. Oh yeah, we don't even have a brewing stand yet, do we? Yeah, we don't. We've never even used a brewing stand. <laughs> we got to this level, normally people in Minecraft have to use a brewing stand. I'm like, what? What's a brewing stand? Oh yeah. <laughs> I shot it right back at you. I did it again. These arrows are more expensive than expensive than you are. How dare you make me waste my ammo like that? Whoa. Enchantments. Insight 3, Sharpness 5, Reaper 4. What does Reaper even mean? A grafter? Ooh, a grafter would be good, actually. I know grafters are really useful in forestry. Draconium block and lapis gets with the reaper enchantment. Excuse me? What the fuck it does it do? When applied to killing a mob, it has a chance of dropping a corresponding mob soul. Oh, and with a soul, you can right click on a stabilized mob grinder to change it to that enemy. And then you can just spawn that enemy. So it's an easy way for me to basically get um, a golden... It's a roundabout way of the golden lasso, which we already have. So Reaper is actually kind of... We'll take both. Let's take the Elytra and see if that's used for anything. Used to make the Opinion Core. Amazing. Opinion Core inspiring. Dark Steel Upgrade Elytra. Upgrade for Dark Steel items makes armor work as Elytra. That means flying as if Elytra was equipped, not creative type flight. Yeah, that's kind of worthless. A division sign. You can make a stable division sign with one of these and a bunch of other things. Holy crap. A totem of undying, which drops from the evokers. I see, I see interesting and i can also make a electric jetpack attached elytra with industrial craft too i bet this jetpack yeah it takes a bat box and a bunch of bullshit that i do not care about uh what other uses it got on it you can make a harness base for to make an elytra harness as a bauble that'd be an interesting that's actually not bad as a replacement for our glider because the elytra is just a glider that's all it is it's the same thing it's just an equipable glider which is slightly better than just having a glider because if i don't have to even pull it out then yeah that sounds great you can mend it with a fluid tank with liquid xp that's cool okay Looks like we'll probably just turn it into a stable div division symbol when we get to that point. Oh, Dragon's Breath. I didn't collect any Dragon's Breath, dude. Why didn't I do that? I should have known. Also, I need Chorus Flower. Division signs are used to make unstable ingots. That's right. And to make... And unstable ingots are used to make... This stuff's impossible to make by, by the way, because in order to make a divi well, I guess they're not impossible to make. Hmm. I guess I'm just not sure why I'd make inst unstable boots and stuff like that. Like, does that kill you? What about unstable axes? 
thing is, is that as soon as the ingots leave your inventory, they explode. So if you like, and they explode in like 10 seconds, that's one stable. Oh, to the portal to the deep dark is what I need them for. So when I get to that level, I'll need a division sigil. Also to make moonstone, which is made ethereal glass, infallible glass, dark infallible glass. What is this shit? What are y'all doing this for? Why? Uh, why? Oh boy, this is this is just too much for my little brain already. Silver, iron, I don't want any of this. Iridium, I will take because I'm fairly sure we're gonna need a lot of that. Oh, the machine, <laughs> machine gun shot me out of the air. Fucking <coughs> <coughs> going on a shulker hunt. Ain't gonna stop until I weed him out. Damn, they really don't drop their shulker boxes this often. Like, what the fuck? But he dropped stuff. My understanding of levitation has been filled to new heights, guys. Oh, hey, look. The uses of these health potions for once. We got seven shulker shells. Vanilla to iron shulker box upgrade. Oh, fuck. You need a sh shulker shell for... Oh, boy. <laughs> So to make a normal shulker box, we need two shells and a chest. To upgrade it to an iron version or a copper version, then we need a shulker shell for each one on top of it. All right. Well, that was it. So I guess let's just go back. Gotta go back. Oh, yeah. Let's get some of the flowers real quick. Need an axe. Fuck that shit. The flowers are used to also make the cores an end exchanger. What? Shulker pearls. What are those used for? To make a pearl block. Monolith of experience. Monolith of spawning. Pearled ender hopper. Teleports nearby items to the container it is attached to. Sneak right click on the hopper should display the reach of the hopper unless disabled. So it's a vacuum hopper. Okay. That's an interesting alternative to the vacuum hopper. But what does a pearled one do? Instantly teleports nearby items. Wow, that's even better. This is an upgrade. Unlike its predecessor, this version will not create particles. Oh, and it's even particle free? That's insane. Okay. That's pretty good. Now, what does the monolith of experience do? We'll absorb all experience orbs in the same chunk. This experience can be retrieved by right clicking the monolith. Oh, shit. So it collects experience? What is the fucking monolith of spawning? It increases the amount of natural mob spawns in the chunk it is placed in. Oh, that's cool. Dang, that's a lot of very good stuff. Wow. Shulker pearls are goody good. We'll probably have to go farming for these guys all over again in the near future, knowing my luck. Okay, let's head back. I gotta fly really high up so I can check my map to ensure we're going the right way, because... Oh, shoot, another ship. Well, in that case. Oh, it's got the Ender Dragon head at the top. Why did I even think of that? Gimme, gimme. What is that used for? Holy shit. It gets you a lot of energy through his soul generation. Uh, it doesn't give you much protein, though. <laughs> it makes looting... I guess you can use any head for that, and you can use any head for that. Okay, it's not all that special, but it makes a lot of energy if you want. So since I killed them all, I now have 13. That's pretty decent. Yeah, 13. Nice. All right. Now let's look at the map. All right. So it looks like we came from here. I'm going to guess somewhere over there. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it was either here or here. 
I'm going to say it was here. Oh, no, the game crashed. Fuck me in the butt. If you guys like that, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you the next time. Bye-bye!